hello welcome back to our channel today i'm going to show you guys how to make these chocolate chip blondies so first i'm going to start off with some melted butter and then i'm going to add in some brown sugar and now i'm adding white sugar and you want to stir that together until like a paste like liquid forms but not well not necessarily a paste you want it like a thick liquid if that makes sense um you just want to stir that until it's well combined Now I'm gonna crack in two eggs, and yes, I did get the shell out, so I don't need to hear y'all. I did get the shells out, so don't come for me. And you're gonna stir that until it is well combined. Okay, so now that that's well combined, we're gonna add a pinch of salt. And I was using iodized salt, so I only had to use a little bit, but ideally you want to use uh, like a uh, sea salt or flaky salt. And I, then I added in some vanilla, and then now if you're uh, measuring the flour appropriately, um, you're going to grab a spoon and then like, you know, scoop it into the measuring cup. But I didn't measure like that, I just poured it. So it only ended up being about a cup of flour for me, but overall you just want to get this consistency. And I had to switch to my uh, spatula because it was starting to get really thick. And when it gets to that point, you know, obviously put the whisk down and switch it out. And now I'm going to add in my semi-sweet chocolate chip chunks. You can use, I meant chips. Ideally, you want to use chunks though. But I had chips, so I just went ahead and used chips. And the reason why I used semi-sweet instead of milk chocolate is because this mixture is already really sweet. So I didn't want the flavors to clash together. Um, so that'll give it like the perfect um, balance because it won't be too bitter, but it also won't be too sweet. And this is my brand new partner woman uh, baking pan. So this is my first time using it today and I was really excited. And yeah, I sprayed it with some nonstick spray, then spread it out in an even layer. Then I'm going to top it with some extra chocolate on top. Um, bake for about 20-25 minutes and voila, that's how you make blondies. Bye!